Hello, this is Nerzman from the Maxon training team. And in today's quick tip, I'm going to show you how to align all the joints in a hierarchy to a custom axis. I have this mixer mode joint hierarchy. And if I middle click here to select everything, you will see that all the joints are pointing their Y axis towards the next joint in the chain. And that is uh, true across the whole rig. But some uh, motion capture systems require you to have all the axes of the joints aligned with the world XYZ axes. And it may appear that we need to go to this one by one and use the axes tool to reset the rotations, but actually there's a tool for this. And of course, you can do this using a character definition, but if you want to avoid that and just uh, use the rotations from the motion capture directly, you may want to do this. In any case, let's just middle click to select all the joints and go to the character menu and bring up the joint align tool. And now let's just tell it that the axis needs to be one of the axes, let's say the Z and uh, in uh, world axis mode and the up axis is the Y again in world axis axis mode. You click align, you will see that all the joints now are pointing in the same global X, Y, Z. Now there's one thing you may observe that if you go down the list of joints, some of them have different numbers and although the orientation is correct, the numbers are incorrect. This is a very easy fix. Just middle click select everything and go and zero out the values. And although it says mixed, now if you go down the hierarchy, they're all zero. Now, what happens if you want to do the same thing, but using a custom orientation? Well, I have the same thing here. I have this uh, random null that has uh, its own little orientation. So let's do the same thing, middle click. Let's go and bring up the same joint align tool. But this time, what I'm going to say is the Z axis is going to be an object axis with this object as the source, and the Y axis is gonna be an object axis with this object as a source. And if you align this, then you will see if we go to the move tool that now all the joints are aligned to this nulls orientation. The one little difference in this particular case is that because the first joint is parented to a, a null that has a proper orientation, this one will have these arbitrary values, which should be the same as this, and all the others are going to be zeroed out. If you enjoy our quick tips, please like, comment, subscribe, and enable notifications so you never miss another quick tip.